Hello and welcome to this Generation AM tutorial about the proxy tool. When working in larger pipelines, you might find yourself pulling footage off a network which might not be fast enough to provide the necessary bandwidth for playback. Or maybe you are working with RAW files or EXRs, which are computationally expensive to decompress or debayer. Generation helps in situations like these by providing a sophisticated proxy and mirror system. The proxy tool can be accessed at different locations in Generation, either from the Tools menu in the toolbar, or from the Play View context menu, or from the Proxy menu in the menu bar. The proxy menu also allows for quick access to the various proxy formats and locations. The proxy mode defaults to base, which means that the original files are played back. Let's open the proxy tool. On the top you will see three different proxy locations, labeled Global, Local and Network. Each location points to a specific path on your file system. The path for Global is set in the generation config file and cannot be changed within the proxy tool itself. The paths for Local and Network can be edited directly and can be individually set for each project. Network proxies are particularly useful if you are hosting review sessions with Generation to allow artists or clients, connected for example via VPN, to participate in that session. Although it is possible to create multiple paths in each proxy group, it is suggested to stick with single paths as they are much easier to maintain when backing up the project or moving it to a different location. Render source can be used to specify where the files are pulled from for creating the proxy. For example, if you already created a local mirror of the files, you might want to render the proxies from these mirrored files, rather than pulling the originals over the network again. The quality switch relates to raw files that have multiple resolutions encoded, like for example footage shot with a red camera. When set to full quality, the highest resolution with full debayering will be used to generate the proxy. This is computationally expensive and might take some time. If you only need low resolution reference proxies, you can set this to a lower quality, which tremendously speeds up the creation of the proxies. You can create a number of different proxy resolutions in different formats, as well as mirroring the original files to your local hard drive. The different resolutions are defined in the generation config file. Have a look at the manual to learn how this is done. Click on any of the proxies to start the rendering. While rendering, generation will skip existing proxy files and only create new proxies for footage that has not been rendered yet. Shift click on a proxy to force the re-rendering of all files. After rendering, Generation will activate the selected proxy. You can tell from the overlay in the top left corner of the footage, as well as from the proxy menu itself, which proxy version is currently used. Should there be any missing proxy files, Generation will automatically fall back to the original files for playback. In that case, the overlay turns red to inform you that the requested proxy files are missing. To disable proxy playback and work with the original files, you can either open the proxy tool and select Disable Proxy, or press Shift together with the number of the currently active proxy. In this case, Shift 1. Pressing Shift 1 again will switch back to proxy mode. This also is a great way to toggle between proxy and original files. In the storyboard, you can see a proxy indicator in the Micon section of each clip. Each of the five dots stand for one of the proxy resolutions. The dot in the middle represents a mirror of the file. Upper left, upper right, lower left and lower right stand for proxies 1, 2, 3 and 4 respectively. The indicator is a great way to get a fast overview of the available proxies directly from within the storyboard. This concludes the proxy tool tutorial for Generation AM. Stay tuned for more tutorials here on our YouTube channel 
and check out our website for an evaluation copy. Generation AM. Just change the speed you work.